Welcome to my channel IT Smart Training. Today's video is on recipient creation and send receive email in Exchange Server 2019. So if you like my videos, please subscribe my channel and share my videos. You can also connect me on my Facebook account. The URL is https colon double slash www dot facebook dot com slash IT Smart Training. So let's start the video. So I have a two server. One is a domain controller, another one is exchange server. At first, I connect. The, at first, I uh, create the recipients or a user in the exchange server. Uh, so at first, I we have to know the process to creation of the recipients in exchange server. So to do this, we have to connect exchange server admin portal https colon double slash ten dot ten dot ten dot two two one slash ecp this is the exchange portal provide the password or a domain name smart lab is a domain slash administrator is username and provide the password So this is my uh, exchange admin portal. Under the CPNs, you use a plus button. Just click new mailbox. Type a name alias here, just like user one. It is a new user. First name is user one. Last name no need. We have to put the. Uh, uh, only the asterisk marks uh, column use login name also user one password complex always provide a complex password here is the option required password to change log next logon so if I select this option uh, the user must change the password while in he or she login so just save so user 1 is created ok then I go to my next machine here is uh, typing https colon double slash 10 dot 10 dot 10 dot 221 slash owa to access the um, client portal Outlook Web Access Portal. So here it is open. Go to Advanced. Proceed. Type a domain name here. Smart Labs slash user one. Provide the password. Uh, select the country. I select English. India. Time zone is GMT five thirty. Uh, you can select your time zone I in here I select my time zone so this is my mail portal okay so I just logged out I just logged it out and this is how we can create a recipient uh, with the help of exchange uh, control panel now we create uh, another way to create a recipients that is with the help of Active Directory. Suppose um, in my scenario uh, we have already an Active Directory environment. Okay. So in here go to run dsa.msc. Suppose we have an Active Directory environment and there have some users like new user uh, usr2 
user 2 so is this user is already created the next div directory uh, this is the new uh, previous setup of my active directory but the, uh, for my company requirement we install an exchange server in exchange server we cannot found uh, that user 2 in the portal because that active directory is uh, active directory user is resides inside the entity.t file in or inside the active directory so if i uh, put that user uh, inside the exchange server so i have to click add user mailbox here is an option existing user go to browse here you can view the users which is resides inside the active directory so user 2 is resides in the active directory I just select user 2 and press ok no need to provide this options it will automatically take the credential initials login name uh, which is already provided in active directory just save it user t uh, user 2 mailbox is created so one more thing I have to tell you that user 2 account is created over here but mailbox is not created uh, yet so if I want to create a mailbox so what I have to do I have to log in once when user logged in then only the user mailbox is created so before I log in the user mailbox is not uh, inside the act uh, action server just logged in same I just set to English India time zone GMT 530 save so it is logged in so this is how we can create a recipient with the help of exchange admin center or exchange control panel or with the help of active directory uh, one more thing uh, when we create an user in active directory that is not redirected or that is not uh, be a mail enable user and that is not also in the exchange exchange uh, 2019 database but if I create a user from exchange server that is also a mail enable user and that is resides inside the exchange server as well as the active directory this uh, this is uh, very important for you so now I send receive mails and mails are working or not I have to check so I just select new mail my user is user 1 at the very top smartlab.com I send a test mail send I mail I send a mail from uh, user two to user one. Now I just logged out with user two and logged in with user one. Logged in. mail is already received by uh, user 1 which is sent by user 2 ok so this is how we can create recipient and send receive email in exchange server one thing I more want to do I have to send another mail from user 1 to user 2 
sign out. I'm just logged into the user two. See, user one is also user two is also receive a mail from user one. So this is how we can create uh, our recipients and send receive mail from Exchange Server 2019. Thanks for watching. See you on my next video.